So in this video, I'm showing a patient with excessive knee flexion throughout the gait cycle. The phases that are affected by this deviation are initial contact, loading response, mid stance, terminal stance, pre-swing, and terminal swing. All because these either require knee extension, five to, five to zero degrees of knee extension, or um, plantar flexion, which this patient, patient also doesn't have. Um, the functional tasks affected would be swing limb advancement, weight acceptance, and single limb support. The task accomplishments that are affected because of this excessive knee flexion are limb advancement, stability, and shock absorption. Uh, the causes of this deviation of gait could be lack of knee extension, uh, passive range of motion, some knee pain, and insufficient quadriceps strength. Uh, this view is from the frontal angle and the previous was from the sagittal.